Thanks. Have you seen Berlin? Emirates, you all the other Oh, there were more fire on behalf of the male senators. <laughs> you remember there was a wheelbarrow that costed 18,000. Yeah, so are you comfortable? Great, you may take it back, please. Okay, another. See the cards of the test for us. <laughs> the active young senator. Can you try it? <laughs> the young senator. Uh, senior class. <laughs> you know we are told it was the wrong to be. Yeah, see there. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> Chimera last. It was, you know, it can fit the two of you, maybe you and your spouse. <laughs> Good, you can be taken. Now you see it. Familiar, you have seen it? Good. That is the chair that uh, the director for How would I, how would I know? I I don't interface with the CFO when it comes to payments. I have an assistant, because, an administration officer that does Mr. all these Mr. things in my office. Mr. Duol, you are raising heavy weather on the issue of use of impressed accounts. Yes. But I want you to confirm to this committee that personally you are a beneficiary of funds that have been processed through impressed accounts. Yes or no? I am not saying, Chair, that not all impressed payments are thefts. Not all. So not all impressed No. 20-30% okay. are legitimate business expenses. So when I was out there in one of the funerals, I made a political statement around plunder and theft of public money in the executive, I was subsequently summoned. Uh, I was just laying the background. Subsequently summoned by the assembly and uh, chair, it would, uh, and committee, it would interest you to note that the gentleman uh, that summoned, uh, uh, issued the first summon uh, for uh, the general, for the general uh, uh, oversight committee. The chair, the, the gentleman that issued that summon, was the chair of the ad hoc committee for my impeachment, the Honorable uh, Francis Otiato, and he was a witness here uh, yesterday. And I will be explaining the importance of that in a little while. The relationship between Governor and I, our difference is ideological, it's not personal. He's my friend, very good friend of mine. So if we can address the ideological uh, governance issues, really, uh, we would, you know, uh, work. And I have said many times that, you know, if my governor called me tomorrow or today, I would run to him and I would show him the loopholes. And once we fix, we would uh, go and work for the people here. Because as we have this protracted battle, service delivery is impacted.